hi everyone welcome to my channel this is your girl Empress Jam I'm here today to do a quick tutorial on these two strands um, two strand twists that I've been working on um, I've been doing it since morning because um, on and off because of course you know we when you have kids you don't get that much time to sit and, and do in one go so what I've been using I a story behind um, my hair I've been I've had my locks since August 2008 and um, throughout the period of having my locks I've had um, traction alopecia because what happened I used to um, comb my hair too I used to style my hair I, I love styling my locks and I intend to share a lot of these styles with you and um, what happened is I used to pull my hairline too tight during the styling so as a result I had thinning hairline but it grew back and then I got pregnant and that just went out the door again it just started getting thinner and thinner so but even though my hair grew the hairline didn't grow as much but since I got pregnant it just went and so um, since I had baby I researched and this is one of the best shampoo there is to use to restore my hairline so it says for thinning hair and it's the honeydew hair loss shampoo it has lots of good stuff the oba oil coconut um argan rosemary even primrose tea tree green tea biotin all the good stuff and it's really good so what i do i shampoo like twice bi-weekly so about four times per month and occasionally like um, during the week I'll just um, use a small bit and wash my just a, just this section of my hair and what I do for moisture to um, wet because as I said I washed two days ago so I'm just twisting that's why I had it out in my first video because I just washed so I am just twisting now because I didn't want to do any Thing to my hair because I wanted to just you have it laid freely that's the best way to restore your hairline but what happened is I decided to you know what just twist it because it's winter even though it's down south and we don't have much um, we don't have much um, of a cold or winter so to speak we do have the um, of course the effect so I wanted to twist so that um, you know like a protective styling so I'm twisting and I'm using the African Grow, Super Grow, the Super Grow um, African hair gel. And it has, um, it's extra old, I, I bought the, ex, um, the extra hold and it's um, the Genuine African Formula brand. It comes with biotin and placenta extract, don't ask me how they got that. But it's really good and one of the ingredients, one of the things that I learned that to ensure that you're not putting anything in your um, locks that is harmful is that it should the first ingredient should be water so um, as we say in Jamaica water so it should be purified water and um, you know not any beeswax and all those things because it tends to um, result in buildups in your hair and you don't want that so I'm twisting and I'm just putting some of these little gold hair string that they put in on locks and braids these days but I'm gonna put it on my locks and one of the things I love about locks is um, it's very versatile and it's so flexible people a lot of people don't know how many styles you can do with your locks and that you can do just about anything any style so what I do I spray and then I spray it straight along to the to the ends and then I you I take a portion a small portion of the gel and I put it on the root because I my hair as you can see the length and I don't have time to put it in all the hair and I just palm roll because um, interlocking takes forever and uh, I don't have that luxury anymore so you palm roll right I don't use clips when I palm roll I'm tender at it so yeah and, and, and it's why I had traction alopecia because I I'm tender edit and I style my hair I go to sleep with it and then so I am really and the last time I twist my hair I 
actually ended up doing one too tight and some of the roots it pulled out from the roots so yeah no not not no no bueno so um i just palm roll as i said and then um i palm roll like six locks because i want a twist to be really big i don't want it I, I want it big and fluffy not thin as i've done in the past and uh, so i have like six locks so i put separate three each and before i twist i spray again and then again i separate i put three each and uh, so you hold the hair and you watch me so you're gonna roll you're basically rolling 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 in the opposite direction of each the two sections so it's three each and then you roll so I don't want to roll too tight again because it's pulling my hair so the front one's not gonna be too um, tight so then you roll and then you put together right twist opposite direction and go see so you're just rolling twisting roll twist roll twist together roll twist together roll twist roll twist roll twist roll twist, roll, twist. see and you keep going so um, I'm putting in the gold strings so because I had was demonstrating to you I didn't put in the string so now I'm gonna go back and I just put it section it that it has even ends on both sides again and I just continue rolling as if I'm twisting the hair the string in, inside the hair so I go like that in the opposite direction again roll twist across roll twist across roll twist across twist roll twist across roll twist across roll twist roll twist across roll twist so here is a little bit um thick so i want to do it a little tighter so it blend in evenly and then roll twist roll twist okay and you go and you keep going right. and then because I don't want to do my hair dry and my hair is already dry so to my size I occasionally spray while I'm twisting and I twist and twist and twist so you see why I'm trying to um, these simple go-to styles now because guess what um it's less time consuming and it lasts a little longer so if you notice at the end here look so we have one long lock and then the others are here so what i do i do a little barrel twist so i'm going to twist this around the ends the small the other small um shorter lock ends and then i bring this up and secure the ends with my rubber bands. These are also got off Amazon. All right. And I secure the ends with the rubber bands. Yeah, I'm in the sunroom. That's my little secret. This is in my pillow. Say so this is my happy place. Okay, I don't need to say anything more. All right, so that's the this side and because this side is 10 a little bit more receded i tend to do that more and then i put some of the gel here because i don't want to bring in any of what's already growing up back so you see it's there it's just that i don't want to pull them in to the locks because as i said it's receding i don't want to make a already bad situation worse and so um, you'll notice that I only have a few left because I was working on them the earlier today. So I'm almost there. Thank God, thankfully. 
please remember to like and share subscribe leave your comments below tell me what you think how do you style your locks what the styles you like to see one of my favorite style is the pipe cleaner curls and um i oftentimes do that because i like my hair curly like keisha charmaine um for those some of you who follow um her she's a youtuber she does she has long locks and she styles her locks really well and she likes curls and i like when she do the rod curls my favorite is the uh, pipe cleaner curls that i often do it's like my signature style i love that i'm gonna do that for you um soon so look out for that video as well so i do this and i use my thing to secure the ones that's not yet done so let's do this one so of course as you see i spray it again and i put the gel at the roots and I think there's no buildup. That's one of the reasons why I love this gel so much again. Um, I love it so much because the Super Grow, I don't think it is, it's what made my hair grow anyway, but it's really good because it doesn't leave any buildup and it doesn't make my hair age because I have sensitive skin and of course, um, if I put anything that's, just remotely has any form of petroleum jelly in it there goes the hitching and uh, there goes my seborrheic um, dermatitis i once had so i don't want that so just the good stuff so it's really good i mean it's small they do have the 16 ounce but um i just usually buy the small box a smaller bottle because usually when i'm doing my hair my son is always around and he tend to play with it so again so section three three each and roll 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 as you can see here it's rolling rolling and then twist together twist across together twist across together roll twist across roll twist so watch my finger roll twist roll twist and then i keep going so i'm not putting the gold string in all of them obviously don't get too carried away you know i have some other lot jewel i'm gonna put in so so i just roll and twist and as i said I don't do it too tight because i want them to have a little level of thickness because i'm also going to style these again and let you know and show you some ways you can style your two strand twist I don't want to call it two strands twist. It's not really two strands, but anyway, it's more than one, more than two locks that are twisting together. But yeah, basically, this is what I'm gonna do, and I keep going and going, going and going, and again, here you see where the ends again is uneven because I'm waiting for it to grow grow some more so I can cut. Um, I always clip the ends. I ask my husband to clip the ends for me to get it even at the back. So I wrap around. And then sometimes you have someone when you're twisting that it's um, protruded out. So you just push that back in. There you go. And all set. Twist. And then you just use the rubber bands to secure the ends. And that's pretty much it, right? Um, this style was inspired by Jasmine Rose. Um, she's another YouTuber that I follow. I follow them because they have, they do cute lock styles and tutorial. And then now this is going to be one. I just kind of feel to know how thick the, the twist will be so this will be one and then again well from what i've been doing so far i noticed it has been three three i've never counted my locks so i don't know exactly how many locks i noticed that's a thing now where people ask me how many locks do you have no i don't know i don't count it i don't have time to count my locks bless the those who can bless their heart so i spray and after i spray i 
do the roots again with the gel the genuine African formula gel and I do the roots and then I palm roll because it's quicker so I just basically literally as if the term suggests you palm roll just rolling the, 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 um, the hair I don't use pin to secure the twists because they tend to just fall in place you just twist in the opposite direction to ensure that you know and the new growth I don't want them twisting in other hair so twist and I do that really fast because uh, I'm pretty sure that it's almost done yeah and I have one more two more so I didn't catch a gel so there you go so what I noticed what I've been doing as well is I've been using the crochet pin I'll use it and show you that I use to interlock but I only interlock again as I said like twice per year because it I think it makes your hair thinner and that's what I used to use so I think it contributed as well to my traction alopecia at the front so I spray again before I twist and again the three and this is probably seven because I'm feeling like three on one side and four on one side but that's okay and again you roll twist roll first roll roll the finished product don't forget to like and subscribe like share and subscribe thanks for watching like